now we'll come to the next question this question now related to your stocks and shares partners if i think enough that much is enough more than that if anything will be there like related to sleeping partner or maybe it is given uh, your profit is going to the charity or you are giving some tax whatever will be give, given you will able to understand what is your net profit means after giving to charity or after giving to the tax after giving to anybody that profit will be shared that profit will be shared or you have taken some loan that loan amount you have to repay then what will happen first profit will calculate that loan emi will go or interest interest amount will go afterward what is the net profit means after doing all the activities financial activity transaction then that profit will be shared between or among the partners okay now we'll come to the stocks and share this question related to a stocks and share Sujay invest partly in 12% stock at 105 and partly in 8% stock at 88. Sujay is having some money, maybe some amount of money. He is investing some percentage in 12% stock at 105 and 8% stock at 88. To obtain equal dividend, condition is there that investment amount will be different, but he is getting equal dividend from both of the investment. Then he must invest in the money in which ratio? In which ratio you should invest in 12% stock 105 and 8% stock at 88 to get the equal dividend. Dividend should be equal. That is condition. That is only condition. Then here dividend, dividend amount, not percentage. Percentage is different. Percentage here already given is 12%. Here it is 8%. Then percent, dividend amount, percentage cannot be. Dividend amount. How to find the dividend amount? Total investment by market value or we can directly calculate like this just a short form of this formula this is your rate of return this is share is 12 percent 105 this is your 8 percent of 88 then 12 out of 105 what is this one that money invested this will be your dividend means what is your rate of return out of that money invested that will become your dividend that should be equal for 8 out of 88 into m2 means that is money invested in this share that is only question telling okay, dividend should be equal what will be amount of dividend amount of dividend dividend will be dividend 12 percent out of 105 into total money invested that means only percentage of dividend into total money invested or in different way this formula you can write 12 into m1 y105 this is also very fine there is no issue you can understand in this way also if you are getting any confusion just i will rewrite this is your 12 out okay you can understand same thing in this way also 12 into m1 by 105 what is this one number of shares number of shares into dividend percentage that will give you total income we know this is your income or total dividend total dividend will be equal to your total income total dividend will be equal to total income that much only you are you are gaining from the share dividend percentage will be different total dividend amount will be different income will be equal to dividend percentage into number of shares correct the number of shares is m1 by 105 into 12 same thing you just equate m1 ratio m2 will become 35 ratio 44 think simple you can say it is all 